Hi there, my name is Frederick. I'm the founder of Profitmetrics. In this video, I would like to show you how you use gross profit inside Google Analytics. First here, I've went to the acquisition and then down to the source and medium report. That's one of the most used ones. Um, as default, Google Analytics show you e-commerce, which is revenue um, your store has generated and uh, it's just sending it into Google Analytics. What profit metric does is it actually make another goal here, which uh, you do when you connect uh, Google Analytics with profit metrics inside the dashboard. This goal is called gross profit. And what it does is it sends the real gross profit inside Google Analytics. So, so it takes all the cost prices, shipping cost, payment fees, um, extra cost, whatever you have put into your settings. And then it sends each order back to Google Analytics and Google Analytics attached or attributed to the right source and medium. So you can actually see the profit of each source instead of just the revenue, which is like pretty misleading. Um, another really used report is if you go to Google Ads, for example, you can just yeah look at your campaigns. Seconds. Um, here you can see the ad cost of each campaign and actually see the profit next to it which means you have a much better view, better view of what, what you've used on the, the uh, campaign and what profit it generated. So these two numbers subtract from each other is your total net profit. Here is the gross profit. Another way you can also go through your ads is you can go down on search queries and here you can actually see what you have paid for each keyword and what profit it has generated. So you have a very transparent view here in, the, in this report using profit metrics because instead of the revenue, you use the growth profit. This is it. And if you have any other questions, please shoot us a mail or go to, to the chat and uh, we'll, we'll love to help you. Have a really nice day. Bye.